guys, what's going on? My name is Portion Effects, and today I'll show you guys how to make smoke and particles in After Effects. So let's start. First, you want to do is right click right here and go to new composition. So, depending on your intro size, just go with what you want. I'm gonna have a 1080, so that is 920 by 1080, or you can have one. Uh, 1280 by 720 but I'm gonna stick with 920 and 1090 and frame rate is gonna be 30 frames per second so yeah so let's just press ok so what you wanna do now is right click down here and go and onto solid and make it the color black so now you want to just copy this by pressing ctrl c and just pressing ctrl v afterwards to copy paste so now you see in the you see the middle one right here you want to drag a form on that and then on the top layer you want to add a particular so there you go and now you want to go into disperse twist on the second layer and go on disperse and 7500 and then we can go to particles and set the size to 350 like this it looks kind of weird now but we have to set the opacity down to make it look smooth and nice so what we're gonna set the opacity down to is about 1.2 this looks awesome so yeah now we're gonna start with the particles so we're gonna go on the top layer we're gonna go into emitter set the particles slash sec to 30 now we're gonna go to emitter type and go unbox now we, if we unlock this thing down here we're gonna just type 4000 on every everything so now we are done with this we can go to particles here we're gonna set the life sec to about 4 and size to maybe like a 5 or something so you can see it right now you can see it because it doesn't show at the start but as you can go right in here you can see it nice and smooth so I'm gonna take like a bit 10 that's a perfect size for me then I'm gonna, I'm gonna change the color to blue because that's nice and smooth so now we have these uh, smooth particles so uh, yeah it, it, it isn't really much other than this you can of course change something here to like glow spray but I don't really like it it looks quite stupid you can also set the opacity down if you want to, if it's the particle is a bit high, or the smoke as well, if it is a, if it's, it, it is a bit high. And also, you can go and change the color, of course. Then you can change the opacity random, might a bit like this. Then I'm gonna show you some more settings you can do. It's optional, but you can do. It. So we can start off by going to not shading um, I think it is color random you can just shake, shake, change it to that if you want rainbow but I don't really suggest that if you don't have rainbow text so yeah on physics you can go and take the gravity so it only goes upwards I really like this in some bigger particles and this looks nice as well but the bigger particles looks best with this you can also turn the air on and wind like this like so this looks quite nice very windy now also see that the, it just pops up particles we don't want that so we're gonna go to opacity over life and actually press this one right here so now we have a smooth go in and smooth out. Now these particles are really nice. So yeah, that was literally it for this tutorial. I know this tutorial is quite fast, but that's okay. 
because it's quite easy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of tutorial series. Go down in the comment section, um, just give me some suggestions on what I should do, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.